guys, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to do a really, really quick video about toddler stocking fillers because Billy's at the age now where he kind of has things he's interested in and he is kind of into the whole Christmas thing and he's excited and he keeps saying the word presents um, and he's asked for a micro scooter so uh, hopefully Santa will bring a micro scooter and a helmet um, but I wanted to get a few little bits to go with it so what kind of stock and fillers could Santa bring to your toddler I went out and got some um, bits and bobs just to give Santa some ideas and I wanted to show you all so we're feeling very Christmassy we've settled in really really nicely to our new little house uh, this is our chair I love this this is like a throw I got in pennies Primark last year and then we have our Christmas at the Burns plaque up here and all of our Christmas cards are on display so I'm feeling very very Christmassy and I'm nearly there what I need to get done before the big day itself so anyway I'll crack on and tell you what stocking fillers Billy can expect on Christmas morning from Santa. I got saw these in pennies also known as Primark when I say pennies I mean Primark and um, so it's Paw Patrol toothpaste and Paw Patrol two brushes and they were 145 each so less than three euro for both of them and they're really really cute he loves Paw Patrol really really trying to get him to brush his teeth at the moment and to kind of be a bit more consistent with it so I think this will definitely help so all of his favorite characters are on it and I just thought the toothpaste was really cool that was at the tail in Primark as these things often are. Next up, keeping with the theme of Paw Patrol, I got him some Paw Patrol socks. I actually got these in their George Asda. So I ordered them online because Asda now deliver to Ireland, which is great news. Um, the quality of the Asda clothes is really, really good. Um, I think Santa might be bringing him some Paw Patrol Asda pajamas as well. So um, the colours are really vibrant and Again, it's just a novelty item that will fit in his Christmas stocking, so I just thought it was really cute, so I picked them up as well. More Paw Patrol. These are so cute. They're age two to three, but they're size six to eight and a half, so he's kind of like a seven, so they're perfect size. And um, Little slippers, but they're just kind of soft, kind of slipper socks, and they have the grip at the bottom. And again, they have the Paw Patrol cars on the front, and they're really, really cute. I got those in pennies as well. They're all the Paw Patrol things. Moving on to puzzles. I went into my local Eurogiant, um, it could be a pound shop to you. I think they're all run by the same company. Um, but everything is usually like one euro, one fifty, one pound, depending where you're from. So I just picked up two jigsaw puzzles. Both of them were one euro fifty cent each. So three euro for two jigsaw puzzles, which I thought was really good value. This is Mr. Tickle, so it's the Mr. Men series. Uh, windy day outside, 30 pieces. And it's just a really nice size. It's really light. It'll fit in his stocking. And it's nice and colourful. And I just thought it was really cute. That would be really cute for a girl or a boy. And then I got this uh, Penguins Madagascar 45 puzzle uh, piece. I thought this was really cute because it actually has a little like holder and it has like one piece of, uh, well it's not of the jigsaw but just one jigsaw piece there. I thought that was really cute and again a handy little sturdy box to put it away and a nice size so that you don't have massive boxes of for, you know your, your bits and bobs and broken jigsaw pieces. I can just put it all back in here, stick it in a little drawer and it's fine. So two little jigsaws which I am really really happy with. Next up are books. I got all of these books in Deals. Again, I think Deals is, well, no, it's all over. I don't know if it's in the UK. It's in Ireland and it's actually in Spain, randomly enough, but it's part of the Eurogiant family as well. So again, you're talking about your local pound shop. So this is Snow Time Stories. Really, really cute. There was two or three different types. So there's three stories all together. They had lovely little pictures and not too much words, but enough words. Really, really cute. And I look forward to reading those from over the Christmas period. This is Merry Christmas Little Mouse. I love these books that are kind of flat and longer because they're easier to stack, I find. They take up less space. Um, again, these are gorgeous um, illustrations inside and they're probably stories that are suitable for his age because they're not too long but they're long enough to keep him interested and finally we have the Christmas hat Billy has a bit of a thing about uh, elves he loves elves and he's two books with elves so I, when I saw this I said I'll have to get it um, and it's another Christmas themed book again another one of those flat kind of lightweight books next up he loves cars like loves cars so I was thinking I'm going to just stick this in his stocking. This is a five pack of mini street racers and they were only 150 as well in deals. Yep. Yeah. So your local pound shop, really handy. They're only 150 If they break, it's not a big deal. But actually he has something similar to this, much smaller, which we got for the airplane we we're going on holidays and he still has them. So they're actually not as bad quality as you might think. And finally, what Christmas stocking would be a 
Christmas stocking without some chocolate. So I picked this up again in my local pound shop. It's a little decoration, ch uh, Kinder Chocolate Mini. It has seven mini bars in it. I think all kids love Kinder. So I thought it was really cute, Christmas themed, and he's gonna get so much chocolate and stuff from everybody else, and he's already eaten so much chocolate and crap at the moment. So I just wanted to get one kind of treat for him um, for the day. But yeah, that's it. So let me just add up what everything came to. So, so basically everything that's gonna be going in Billy's Christmas stocking came to 20 euro. So 20 euro for all that stuff. You've got several books, you've got novelty clothes, you've got the toothpaste, the toothbrush, some cars, um, some chocolate and puzzles. And I think I done really, really well for 20 euro. So his main present, as I said, is a micro scooter. So I didn't want to spend a fortune on other stuff. So if you're looking to give Santa some ideas over the next few days, you might like to tell him to hit the local pound shop and Primark and you will get all of the bits and bobs you need. And hopefully this might have given you some ideas. So this will be my last video before Christmas. I hope everybody has a wonderful Christmas and a very, very happy new year. And really, thank you so much for supporting my channel. And I will see you all very soon. Bye, happy Christmas.